Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how you can add little logos or patches or text to your clothing of your avatar. What you need is a Puyomi shader. We're going to use Puyomi shader for our tutorial and we're going to use decals, which is basically what decals are basically for. You can also use them, for example, to have graffitis on walls and stuff like that. But today we're going to be doing stuff with our clothing. So let's say we're going to add a little logo to this area. So first I'm going to select my decal. I'm going to enable it, decal zero. I'm going to select it. And let's say I'm going to use something from Gogo logo. It has some nice icons. There we go. Let's use the dance. Let's see. When you can see, I cannot see anything. So first I need to select the correct UV map. Usually it's zero, but for me it's one. Uh, now I can see something, but it looks not as what I want it to look. So now we're gonna use the super cool alt positioning tool. So we're gonna click open positioning tool. And you're gonna see this. And what is in the background is the texture of that is used on this material. It's basically the texture used for the clothing. So I'm gonna click and drag one of these corners so I can resize my decal. And I can also click and drag around, it's very intuitive. You just scale it and it's kind of finicky, you have to be somehow careful. And you're gonna also drag it and you can see how I can position it. Make it a bit, oop, I didn't want to do that. You can also do control Z to do back, by the way, it works. And I kind of have to do it a lot, but um, no, this should be fine. So now I just put it here. So this is quite easy and you can put it on any part of this. You can even put it on the back. The only thing I think you, oh, you actually can even rotate. So you can see how here on the shoulder, it's upside down. So I'm gonna actually rotate it using this. I can rotate it as much as I want. You can also put some emission to it, for example, zero point. And it's gonna be nice and emissive. This is super nice and easy to use. It's a super good tool. It's decently optimized as well, much better than you know adding as a separate mesh or whatever. So I definitely recommend using this method. If you want to add a custom uh, text that you do yourself, you can use any image editor, basically. I'm gonna use GIMP, because it's free. Uh, I'm gonna add alpha channel, click delete to you know have this transparent, add a new layer, and I'm gonna add text in white. And it's gonna be bottom text. There you go. Uh, the spacing is a bit too much. Ooh, that's just too much. Let's see. Unruly UI. But it's fine. Uh, yes, we have bottom text. So now I export. Bottom text. I export it into the folder that I use for this. And I'm gonna do the same thing. I'm just gonna change the picture to bottom text. And I'm gonna put it on the back. Uh, change the rotation to zero because I don't wanna rotate it in this case. And I'm gonna make it a bit bigger. And also this way you can keep the resolution much nicer. There you go, you can add, for example, your uh, your name, club, name, logo, whatever, anything you want, anything you can put into a picture, you can put as a decal. Super nice, super optimized, looks really nice. You can also have a mission on it, and all, you know, the normals from the material apply, like these range wraps I have on here. It's really nice, really good function. So uh, let me know what you think, like and subscribe. Uh, Write in comments what kind of videos you want me to do next. 
and uh, I'll see you in the next video.